so much movement for it being 5.29 in the morning. <laughs> Switching to a 15 minute good morning workout, stretch and training. It is 5.55 now. So tired. You could call it a vision or a tether. Take me to the jungle. Teach me tiger law. Read to me. Welcome to it. Today we woke up at 5 a.m. and I'm so tired already but we've literally gotten so much done and I'm feeling so prepared to take on the day so it's amazing. I kind of just wanted to see what all I could get done before 7 a.m. which is the time I normally wake up. Kind of see if it'd be worth it to start waking up earlier or not so we'll see as the day goes on how tired I am and if it's worth it. <laughs> We're about to make my coffee and make my to-do list for the day and all that but I quickly wanted to show you guys some new spring looks from Walmart. Thank you so much Walmart for sponsoring this video today. The clothes I've been wearing are all from Walmart and I have just been obsessed ever since I got them all in I haven't stopped wearing them so let me show you a few pieces first obviously starting with this shirt that I have on it's just a basic white tee I love it because it goes so well with all of the other items that I have I just feel like Walmart has amazing affordable staple pieces for your closet so this is definitely one of them and I also have on these like striped linen pants and they are so comfortable I love that I'm able to create my own unique style by pairing some of the pieces on Walmart also by the way I got all of these online on walmart.com they came so fast with the shipping shipping speeds were amazing so i will have all these linked below if you guys are interested in anything so next up though is this beautiful pink skirt i love pink obviously and i especially love a good little midi skirt with a little slit on it next i have a pair of jean shorts these ones will be absolutely perfect for spring and summer i also love just the details on these look how cute the color the wash everything is just perfect this next piece is something that's a little fun for spring it's this beautiful pink jumpsuit. I think it is so cute and on trend. I cannot wait. I, think I might wear it to a rehearsal dinner that I have coming up. Okay, going off of that, I have another pink dress. I think this is so trendy and this blush color is insane. So cute. It is a pink maxi dress and it has these beautiful ruffles going kind of at an angle. I just feel like this is such nice quality and you cannot beat the price, you guys. This is $29. I am obsessed. I, again, everything's gonna be linked below. This is also gonna be perfect for a wedding that I have coming up. You know, all the spring weddings, all the spring looks are necessary. Okay, and then I have my new favorite pair of pants. I love these linen, almost cargo look pants. I've actually already worn these like three times since I got them in the mail. So cute. They have almost a little wide leg. Plenty of pocket space, the drawstring. I just love this look, especially, again, with this white tee. I also feel like they're perfect for spring because they're just so light and airy, which is super nice. Okay, these next two pieces, they're separate, but I got them to wear together, so... So first you start off with this little skirt. Oh, it's so adorable. I love this little ruffle detail that we have here. Color in itself is stunning and absolutely perfect for spring because, you know, I love the pinks and the blues and all the beautiful pastels. So we have the little skirt, but then we also have the jacket that goes with it. It has this hood, has little pockets, long sleeves, so it's perfect, again, for the springtime. On those days that you don't know if it's too warm or too cold, I feel like it's just great. And then it has almost like a 
quarter zip here, which is really nice. And again, so affordable. And then lastly, I have this little set that came as a set for $19.98. So first it's the pants that are almost like a little flare, which are stunning. And it has this cami tank top. And then over that, you wear this top that ties in this bow. It's adorable all together. Here it is, what it looks like on. I am just obsessed. Again, so affordable. All of these finds I found on walmart.com. I'll have all these different pieces linked below in the description if you guys are interested in shopping any of them because I think they're so worth it. But now it's about 8.15 a.m. and I am so ready for my coffee and breakfast. So let's go make that. <laughs> finally have a coffee. So I've been awake for five hours now, which is crazy. I feel like I've lived a whole day already. Literally have done so much, but now it's time to actually start doing some more work because I feel like everything I've done so far is just like self-care, getting ready for the day, all that type of stuff. So now it's time to actually start the work day. <laughs> I do want to say, I know I'm very blessed. This is like a waking up at 5 a.m. when I don't have to work a nine to five. Like I think if I did, obviously everything in this video would be completely different. So I realize that I'm blessed. I know this is not like a normal routine at all. This is just because I work from home one and I work for myself. So I get to have a very long drawn out morning routine. But yeah, let's go ahead and make some coffee and then we can head out to my office. Honestly don't. I should be the last to know we're all in this. I stand alone. Show me where the end I got stopped halfway on the way out to my office because it's so nice outside today. Sun, we were able to set up our little egg chair fire pit over here, if you can see. She's gorgeous, that took me so long. It was a very fun, but also very hard project. We did that all ourselves. It's so worth it though, I just love staring at it. I could sit out here, honestly, probably should just take my coffee over there and sit on my little egg chair. If it, one day it needs to get a little warmer and just enjoy the mornings over there. But it's really starting to feel like spring here because it's starting to finally show some sun and get a little warmer. I think it's supposed to rain this week, but gotten a few nice warm sunny days so far. <laughs> some of my tasks for you guys. We have a film at my waking up at 5 a.m. video, which is what we're doing right now. Okay, one website page that is for my new business that I'm hoping to launch. All I need to do is finish the website. I just can't get myself to do it. I think it's like a procrastination thing because that means I have to actually do it. So I'm putting it off and I realized how much I dislike writing out words like copywriting, but I'll get there eventually. So I'm starting one page at a time. So if I just do it, like have a goal for one page a day, obviously, then hopefully it'll get done. It Best. Read 10 pages of my money book. I decided to pick back up that book, like you're a blank at making money. So I think I was reading it like, probably like four years ago, three years ago now. <laughs> and then I got bored and stopped reading it because self-help books can be pretty boring to me sometimes, but I'm gonna go at it with like my highlighters and everything this time and just read 10 pages at a time and try and get it through it that way because it is really good information. Film my spring outfit ideas reel, which I actually already did. Film my spring tech refresh video. I'm going to do that after this. Reset my April video calendar, mail out goal book orders, signing guild post office, update my journal pages, and read pots and flowers. So those are some things that I usually do today, but I still have a few more things I want to do this morning with you guys in this video. So we're just going to keep going along. We're going to first start off with doing my reading that I just talked about. <laughs> I 
finishing the 10 pages for today and it had you do like a little journal prompt at the end where it was like you write out 10 reasons for each of these different questions like why I deserve money, 10 beautiful things that have happened in the world because of money, awesome things and experiences money would add to my life and then how will me being rich benefit others. So that's kind of fun to answer all these questions and write out a bunch of reasons. So that was fun. I really like that. I'll just have to keep reading. So I'm literally on chapter two, but I will definitely have to come out here and do that every morning because I really like that. Also, I'm so excited because my rug, I think is gonna come in next week for my office. I finally picked one out. I can't wait because I'm hoping it'll kind of get rid of a little bit of the echo in here. I'm so excited, but now let's go ahead and erase my old monthly calendar and rewrite it. I use this calendar solely for planning out my videos each week, or not week, month, so let's do that. <laughs> Just because I think it's so interesting, I wanted to tell you guys about my ring stats for the night last night. I got a 62 sleep score, which is only fair. Literally got four hours and 45 minutes, so I definitely need to fix that if I'm gonna try and be waking up earlier, especially 5 a.m. Because I got up at 5.03. Then my readiness was a 67, which is also fair. Keep in mind, I think these are out of 100, so these are not my best work. But guess what? My activity score is a 93, which is optimal. I got a crown because I think it's because we did a workout this morning. So my ring is so happy with me. I got to log the workout, which was cool. Um, so yeah, that's just what it's looking like today. It says that I should definitely take a nap, even if it's a 15 minute nap. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna go to bed early though because I have a lot of work I need to do today. But yeah, all right, let's go back inside. I think I wanna repot some flowers. <laughs> I'll be so honest, I don't really know what I'm doing with this whole gardening thing. I'm kind of just winging it. I am taking some of these that are a little leggy, but they're not the strongest, and putting them into bigger pots so I can fill up more dirt where they're not as strong and hopefully they'll grow stronger. I don't really know. And then I also put some of the ones that are really cramped into a bigger pot to see how that'll work over these next few days to see if I need to hurry up and plant these outside. I, it's just so early, but I'm running out of space because I think I planted them in my little trays way too early. So that's how that's going. Um, it looks kind of funny <laughs> but here I have baby's breath cosmos and snapdragons I really love snapdragons so I really hope that these ones can be fixed and come back to life because they're so pretty and then these ones were my tallest ones that I have so far so I was like okay they need to go out and see what it's like in a bigger pot if they'll continue to keep thriving but yeah so I'm also starting to harden them which is like I set them outside for a few hours during when it's warm because it's only been warm these past two days and let them start getting used to you know the wind and the sunlight so you saw Apollo was watching over them yeah it's a beautiful spring day I'm very happy it's perfect vibes for our spring morning stop. can't believe I live in your thoughts I think about you all the time morning evening and midnight such a wonderful delight has been the most lovely spring morning. I definitely need to do this more often, actually waking up early and getting the normal stuff out of the way so I have time to do more fun things and more productive things. But it's about noon now, it's not even the morning anymore, so I need to wrap this vlog up and then go back out to my office and do my work for the day. So I just wanted to say thank you all so, so much for watching as always. You are the best, especially if you've made it to this point in the video. Comment a little pink flower if you made it here because we were just in the garden, in the garden I say. Eventually there will be an actual garden, don't worry. We were gardening and I just think it'll be perfect because that's a pink flower that I'm manifesting for my garden. But yeah, make sure you guys subscribe if you love this type of content for some more and I need to go to work. So I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching.